Yo guys, what's going on? Robert Warshak here, and I'll be going over. Should you buy the Arc Light Booster, the permanent account boost for this game? If I do what I'm supposed to do, it's supposed to pop up on the screen. I think it's around 20 bucks, depending on where you live in the US, it's 20. What this provides your account is a permanent boost forever. I think you get 20% extra experience and 50% extra gold. And this is earned for your account forever. You don't have to buy another one. There is no other one to buy. This is just a permanent account boost, which will help you progress throughout the entire game. Even if you're a pretty casual player, this is a really big deal. Even if you're playing only a little bit every day or a couple hours a week, the fact that it's permanent means that you can not play as much, come back later and still have that boost. It's it's not really similar at all to like other bundles where if you buy like a leader and then they change the leader to make it less good or they make it better. You know what I'm saying? This is just like an account permanent wide buff you do anything in the game you're going to benefit from this what's also neat is it's retroactive so let's say you're not sure if you like the game right you're just starting you're playing you're like eh, i'm not really into this i don't know we'll see this account boost will retroactively give you all the gold that you would have gotten if you would have bought it previously however it does not retroactively give you the experience you would have earned when you click on the booster uh, if it's in your shop for me it will not be because i have purchased it it's the one of two purchases i have made in this game in total it'll tell you like how much gold you have banked which is basically your retroactive payment so you can kind of see how good of a deal you're gonna get i mean if basically a hundred gold is roughly worth a dollar and this thing is probably gonna pay out 1500 to 2000 gold for 20 dollars, you're gonna get a permanent 50 percent extra gold and a permanent 20 percent increase in exp forever you know what i mean for a bundle this is probably the only thing you need to buy in this game forever if you want to buy other stuff cool for 20 bucks i think this is a steal and i know we're gonna get some pay to win comments and that's okay but like what i don't understand why supporting the game that you're gonna play and if you enjoy playing it like buying things or supporting it so the game can keep being the game that you play is a bad thing like i don't understand you know i have hundreds of hours into this game already in my opinion, my $20 has been very well spent on how much fun I've had and how much time I've spent on this game. However, there are a lot of like other bundles in this game that you can buy. Like, for example, for the Horrid. Personally, a lot of these other bundles aren't worth it. You don't have to rate it like this, but I rate it based on how much gold are you getting for how much money you're spending. So I'm getting 750 gold for $10. That is not a good ratio because $10 is worth a thousand gold and you're only getting 750. Granted, there's like, you know, some EXP in here and then like some other stars in here or whatnot, but I don't really care about that because I'm not picking what I'm spending it on. You know what I'm saying? Like these are just leaders I may or may not want to play, but if you have gold, you spend that directly on stuff that you would like to spend it on. So just for those of you who are like, oh, is the Sylvanas bundle worth it? Is this bundle worth it? It really just depends on you. But again, that gold ratio is like really important so if it's like fifteen dollars and you get like five thousand gold that's like insane value right but focusing in on again the arc like booster i think it's a fantastic deal if you have any questions comments or concerns about that let me know in the comment section below but 20 bucks for basically as as much as you can for infinite value technically as you just if you just play the game kind of nutty and as you can see i'm at 110 sigils my total expenditure was the bundle and then someone on stream donated 20 bucks for me to buy another bundle so i spent a total of 40 bucks on a game i have spent hundreds of hours playing and i am pretty far through i uh, only have a couple more heroics left so i don't really uh, know where all these reddit posts are of people spending needing to spend thousands of dollars to play the game when you can just literally play it for free without spending very much at all with that i'm robert warshak hopefully this helped i'll see you in the next video of course and happy whatever the hell day it is